Some of the benefits include access to family planning, antenatal care, pre- and post-delivery visits, deliveries, that is normal delivery and cesarean sections, complications related to deliveries. Just before and after the launch of the benefits package, the authority will invest in massive communication campaigns to inform mothers and all Kenyans of their entitlement to these benefits. Honorable Speaker and Honorable Members, I am aware that some members are thinking that Linda Mama has been scrapped and therefore there is no benefit for women. Honorable Speaker and Honorable Members, I wish to confirm that myself, I am a mother of two. And it, indeed, I am aspiring to be a mother of five. Therefore, the existence of Linda Mama will therefore ensure that all benefits under Linda Mama are ring fenced, not just for myself as an aspiring mother, but for all the women of this country. Honorable Speaker and Honorable Members, I submit. Thank you. Let the questioner. Thank you, Mr. Have Speaker. The I appreciate that we have gotten some response from the Cabinet Secretary concerning Linda Mama. And indeed, congratulate her for aspiring to be a mother of five in the near future and wish you well. However, Mr. Speaker, yesterday morning I visited a facility, a private uh, facility in Kiambu County. After a few women alerted me that they have been apprehended in hospital because they were not able to pay for their medical care after delivery, and they held with them an NHIF card, which was not admissible. I had to plead with the hospital to allow the mothers to leave the facility and give my personal guarantee that should they not be able to care, to take care of their bills, I will do so as a mother. And therefore, when the minister tells us that she acknowledged that there has been a delay of remittance of some fund from Exchequer to some private facilities, she's right. And she says she's hopeful that that remittance is going to be done as soon as possible. She says this week. Ask your so the question is, what remedy should you give to such a mother who called me yesterday? What is she supposed to do when she goes to a hospital to deliver, noting that you, babies don't wait for next week, for exchequer, to pay for the money? What remedy does the minister provide for that mother of Kenya who is now in hospital to deliver, has a card, and it is not admissible in private facility? Thank you. The first joy rider, Irene Mayaka. Thank you, Honorable Speaker, for the opportunity. 